Wait, live? Uh, anyways. Hello everyone, I'm DrexTube, and after a long and necessary break, I'm deciding to start doing YouTube videos again. But before we start, I want to say that these videos are going to focus on Lego builds and some other stuff in between. I decided that because my most recent videos didn't get a whole lot of views and that's why I stopped doing YouTube for a while. But now I'm going to focus on Lego builds only and that should please my viewers from now on. They won't all be dinosaur builds, which is honestly kind of ironic because this YouTube video is going to be about dinosaurs and Legos. But Lego builds are what we are going to focus on around here for the most part. The occasional music video and maybe Pokemon, because I really like Pokemon, but my Pokemon videos haven't gotten a whole lot of views. So anyway, let's get to the video. What you see before you is my Lego Raptor carriage mock. These raptors and this carriage exist made up world where dinosaurs did not go extinct and the humans used the dinosaurs as everyday farm animals. For example, these raptors are being used as horses and the next dinosaur we're going to go over is being used as a cattle or cow. Let's start with the front of this build. And the raptors I don't have a whole lot to say about. They're just Jurassic Park raptors. But they're being connected by this T-shaped build that has lights at the front and an antenna to transmit and receive signals. And what they're pulling is this carriage. Now normally my builds don't have a single color scheme, but I tried to make a single color scheme using mostly gray pieces with this. And I think I did a good job of it for the most part. We've got a small opening here, some red flashing lights here, a little window that the trainer can see out of. And out in the back, there's this little cage that you can open and close. And inside, we've got the trainer and a baby raptor, possibly going to grow up to be one of these big raptors and pull this carriage. And there's not a whole lot else to say about this, it's really simple. So let's move on to the next build. This next build is the Lego Triceratops Cattle Plow. This one particular dinosaur set that was a 3-in-1 had three dinosaurs that you could build from it, a T-Rex, Pterodon, and a Triceratops. And if you remember, I have got two of those already with the Lego Mecha T-Rex and my Lego Quetzalcoatlus. And in their respective videos, I called them mocks, but I don't really feel like that they should be given that title. I feel like the T-Rex is more deserving because I added a lot more to this T-Rex than I did with the Quetzalcoatlus, which just has a long neck and different crest. But anyway, they're not, that's not what we're going to be talking about today. We're focusing on the Triceratops. Now, the Triceratops I know is not a mock because I did not change its body or anything to it in any sort. The part that's a mock is the plow that it's carrying. Now, I imagine that this Triceratops serves as like cattle that pull plows that look like this to help fertilize the plants in a garden and to help those plants grow. And it's connected by two chains and I feel like one is longer than the other because this this side feels a bit more loose. 
And over here, the actual plow, it's got some railings, so any person can stand here. No, hold on, let me get it, get the person. There we go, that's how it look. Now this chest, I'm actually not sure why I put the chest there, it's just for looks, I'm not sure what these people would use them for. But inside the chest we've got a few pieces, it's not too important. And these parts at the back and sides, they really just shoot out seeds to put in the holes already prepared for in the garden to plant the plants and have them grow. I know that's not how actual plows work, but it's my build, so I can do what I want. And uh, that's all I really have to say about this Triceratops and its plow. So anyway, I hope you enjoyed my first video in six months and my first video of 2021. Thank goodness that 2020 year is over. And expect more videos like this in the future. I'll see you later. Bye.